Okay, so we're going to have a look at the skill of cloning, which is taking part of an image and reproducing it in another part. So we're going to take uh, this dog here, we're going to take one of the legs and we're going to try and copy it so that he has uh, an extra leg on his right hand side. So to get that, I need the rubber stamp tool. And what I need to do first is set my reference point. So I find the point I want to start and I hold Alt on the keyboard and press the left mouse button and that sets a reference point. And you can see that's marked by that plus there. And what's going to happen is as soon as I start painting it's going to lock the reference point with the paintbrush. And as I move the reference point moves with the paintbrush. Now if I then let go that reference point is still locked. So I can move around, take the different bits, I don't have to hold the mouse button down all the time. And I can create a perfect clone of that part of the image. And let's say I wanted to reset that reference point. So I want to take some of the some of the coat there and I want to add it to the front. I need to reset that point so I move my paintbrush to where I want it to go. Hold Alt again and left click and I can reset that reference point. And because it's reset and I haven't started doing anything, it's not moving anymore, it's now totally free. As soon as I paint, it relocks it and I can repaint with it. And that's it. And that's cloning. So you can use cloning to either copy parts of an image that you have uh, want to reproduce or you can use it to move parts of the image around if you want to.